What's going on YouTube, Kevin here, and today I want to show you guys the Canon PowerShot Elf 300 hs video quality. Now what you're seeing right now is 1080p video capture, and this camera is extremely small, just going to go ahead and throw that out there. It is a point and shoot camera, but for a point and shoot camera, this video quality is absolutely astounding. Um, switching between low light and high light, it acclimates itself pretty well. Um, in low light, it sucks up as much light as it can get and performs very well. Uh, while in highlight, um, or brightness, I guess you could say, it kind of dims the light ses sensor on it, I guess, and doesn't suck up as much light, and you're going to get pretty equal shots between low light and high light. So getting at that out of the way, uh, it features a 5x optical zoom, um, which is pretty impressive for a camera this small. And then on top of that, when you zoom in, it doesn't pixelate almost whatsoever. I couldn't see any pixelation um, in still pictures or in video um, now, when you're taking the video or pictures, your greens are going to be extremely green, your pinks and purples are going to jump out at you, and your blacks are going to be really black, although you're not going to see any blacks in here. Now, you're seeing right now the pinks and purples, and they really do jump out. Now, this also goes to show that autofocus works pretty well. Um, it didn't work fantastic in this shot right there, just because I was moving the camera around so much because I was walking around in my backyard. But autofocus tends to be pretty accurate. And then on top of that, um, Focusing, it's not going to give you that cinematic look like uh, a lot of DSLRs give you. You're going to have to do that manually in whatever uh, editing software you have. But other than that, it focuses pretty well and like blurs out the background to an extent, but not to a huge extent. Now, moving on, we're going to go ahead and we're just going to walk around my backyard. You guys are going to join me for the ride. And we're going to walk around my backyard and side yard for this uh, camera test. And then I have a vlogging clip at the end. I got some still lifes. Still life links are in the description if you guys want to go see the full pictures of that. But anyway, guys, you can go ahead and just watch the rest of this video. And I'll see you guys in another video. So another real notable feature about this camera is it's really light and versatile and it's good for vlogs and it's good in low light so that's always nice so it's really light again so I'm saying this because a lot of vloggers use this camera uh, it's pretty awesome actually it's really small I'd say it probably weighs about maybe half a pound and it takes stunning photos and really awesome 1080p video like you just saw so I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to walk around and show you guys that this camera is pretty good and it takes pretty nice video. So for vlogging camera, I think this is actually really awesome. Uh, let me know how the mic sounds because I'm not too sure I'm going to be using the uh, Blue Yeti for most of my videos now. But just from a vlogging standpoint, I think I would keep this standard mic on this. And I plan to vlog soon, so hopefully we'll get to that. So anyway guys, that's it for this video. Um, I hope you like it. And if you did like it, uh, tell me how everything looks sounds and everything like that there, there, there's some pictures in the download or in the description for you to look at to see how the pictures look on this and i'll see you guys in another video